Lieutenant. Carry on. Sir, your daughter's with him. Open the gates. But, sir, they're... Carry out my orders. What is it? It's Sitting Bull, sir. Sitting Bull? It's all right. My daughter brought him here. This is my father, General Howe. Sir, may I present the President of the United States? Great White Chief, you promised the Council. Speak, Sitting Bull. 
For many years, I have tried to keep peace between us. A moon has not passed since many men, yours and mine, have shed their blood. For me, there is no joy in such a memory. No, for me, Sitting Bull. That is good to hear. But then why are you now going to kill this man for treason? This man has always risked his life to bring peace between us. He risked his life when he led my people north so that there would be no more killings on both sides. For all time, the Indian will respect this man. When he left my side, I called him my son. I feared for his return. I remember his last words to me. The great white chief will understand what I have done, he said. Kill him, white chief, and your nation will destroy a patriotic son. Only to find their mistake too late. But let him live, and through him, the Indian and the white man can sit again in peace council.